In this video, we are going to see the water level control of a tank using LabVIEW software. So initially, we need to connect a oil loop from the structure pallet. So after having the oil loop, we need to connect the SIP register. So now for have the increment and the decrement, we need to connect a plus one for increment and a minus one for a decrement. After connecting these two, uh, we need to take the uh, selector switch from the comparison palette. So com selector switch having the three terminals. The upper terminal is connected to plus one and the uh, lower terminal is connected to minus one. Now uh, the output of the selector switch is connected to the SIP register. To, to have the control on this selector switch, we need to connect uh, uh, the rocker switch that is main menu that will that we will call as the main menu so that will be taken from the podium pallet so we have the rocker switch so that rocker switch is nothing but uh, on off switch uh, we will we will connect with this uh, rocker switch to the middle of the selector switch now we will rename this uh, select uh, boolean as main menu now again uh, next so the selector switch we will list the name as select in the while loop we need, we need to connect a create control so that will be that will be appear as stop now to see to visualize the tank we need to connect the tank so that will be taken from the uh, front panel so to, we will enlarge this uh, tank the tank is 100 this is the output of the selector it is so now it, now it is okay so when we run this diagram uh, so to see the numeric value of the tank we have the numeric indicator so that will be connected to the output of the select selector switch now it is okay uh, when we run this one uh, when we have the run this diagram uh, run continuously it will be going in negative way so when we turn on this uh, main menu the water level is increased suddenly so in order to limit the water level increment we need to connect the timing circuit so that will be weight ms 18 milliseconds so here uh, we have the con we, we need to connect the constant so that constant let us set as a thousand so that will be nothing but that is nothing but one second thousand millisecond one millisecond so once again we will run this one so here it is going in negative way so here we need to connect we need we need to turn on this main menu when we turn on this main menu the water level is increased so see here the water level is increased uh, by by an amount of one per second so in order to speed up this action uh, we need to set the time as thousand sorry 100 milliseconds so we will set this uh, time as 100 millisecond so we, again when we run this diagram so in, it is going in going in negative direction so when we turn on this main menu the level of the water is increased so increased in rapid way so when we turn on this main menu again turn off this main menu main menu the water level is decreased so we like this way uh, we can have the control on this main menu the water level is increased or decreased uh, by having on off switch so like this we can do the experiment thank you all